Welcome back to the MK10 YouTube channel where today we're going to continue with our F1 2022 career mode. We are in Belgium, the grand grand track of Spa. But before we even get started, please smash that subscribe button, ring the bell to be notified whenever a new video goes live. And leave a comment down below of what other games you'd like me to cover and how you'd like to see this series evolve. But with that, let's get into the qualifying lap. As always, I'm going to go mute for the actual lap itself, and I'll be back at the end. Well, that's not the worst. Of um, obviously some of the corners we did go in too deep, so that's probably where we lost a couple, a couple hundredths of seconds. Apart from that, we should, we should be fine with how we, uh, with um, how we qualified. We've had of our teammate as well, so that's good. We're dominating our teammate, showing that we're the the top dog in. The Ferrari car, but I'll be right back with the highlights of the Spa race. And here are the highlights of the Spa Grand Prix. We do start second as we qualify. There was no grid penalties for us, obviously, because we have all semi-new parts, and we'll probably be swapping some parts out soon. We get an excellent start, an excellent start. We go around the outside. The corner was ours. So there was no contact from us on Max. We pull ahead. On lap four, we we have let Charles pass us because he was lapping faster than us. So we listened to team orders and let him pass. And then and the only problem is once we let him pass, we did invite trouble from Max and also Perez. We were the front four, us, um, Lucami, uh, uh, Max and Perez. No others were, like, they was all too far behind. You see here, Max was trying to overtake us into that car. We were able to shut him down. We got close to our teammate, but as I knew I was going to be pitting for him, there would be no point me overtaking him just to go straight into the pits. The only problem is with that, we do end up actually losing quite a lot of time because when we come out of pits, we come out in traffic. As you see, Max is already making his way through the traffic. I'm well stuck behind um Bissari, the Oscar, I'm stuck behind him. 
There's no way past both the Williams and the Romeo car, Alpha Romeo car. So I have to sit back while Max is getting ahead. Even when we try and take a look at line, cheeky line, we only just make it pass. We do catch up very fast to the Williams car. And the, the Williams car was not as difficult as the Alpha, um, Alpha the Romeo car. I'm stumbling on my bloody words now. You see, we are pushing hard to try and get past Max because we need to get past Max so we can catch up to Perez. And it didn't, it took us until lap 11 to overtake Perez. And it is a Ferrari 1 2. We do finish in second. Let's see how that does for the standings. I believe we're still in first. Max drops a couple of points. Obviously, Leclerc gains a position. In the constructors, we are we are ahead in the constructors. I that one two did help. So this is going to go to the end of the season. Both current championships, both championships are going to end up being like the last race of the season. But thank you for everyone that's watched, and I'll see you all back down at the range.